Hey guys, how are you doing? My name is Fruitchip and welcome back to Kirby's Epic Yarn. So according to the messages and comments I received on the previous part, there is actually going to be one more bonus level in Grassland. So that is what we're gonna do right now. And as always, I hope that you, the viewer, are feeling awesome. Me, myself, I'm pretty good. Thanks for asking. <laughs> but I gotta tell you guys, the rain is just pouring down. I just got home. My jeans is... They were all soaked. My shoes, my jacket, everything was soaked. And my legs was kind of hurting because it was so cold. So I'm glad to be home. It's been raining like freaking fudge for two days straight now. I'm pretty sure it will do that for the rest of the week. But never mind, Weird Woods might cheer me up. So here we go. <laughs> Weird Woods. Oh yeah, ooh. I kind of look forward to see how the theme of this level will be. Weird woods. Hmm, some creepy stuff perhaps, maybe some haunted trees or something like that. But we do have a super transformation right here and... Oh yeah, we know this one. So here we go, we're gonna suck these poor fellas up. They're just trying to hide from me when I'm coming down. That is not gonna work. And you guys probably noticed that the screen is auto-scrolling, so to say. He's not following me. I have to follow the screen if that makes any sense. Let's see if we can do like this. Uh, this little alien starship is, is a little tricky to maneuver, to be honest, but should be fine. It takes a little while to get used to it, but then it shouldn't be a trouble, actually. Oh, okay. Oh, there we have something. Oh, I need more. Oh, we could just do like this. I was afraid that we were gonna miss out on this bonus wheel thing, but there we go. And if you suck up three enemies, you will um, get the electrocuted thing. Uh, that one you can release and break open blocks and uh, kill off enemies and all that good stuff. So, come on, there we go. Ooh, delicious. There we go, let's sneak past this little spiky thing. Ooh, a treasure! <laughs> Super close, I thought I was about to miss out on that telescope. This telescope is perfect for stargazing on a clear night. Man, I would, wouldn't would mind um, owning one of these myself. Imagine just sitting on a cold winter night, looking up at the sky. Oh man, how lovely. And there's another treasure down here. Let's go ahead and grab it. Log cake. This log cake has a yummy cream center. Oh man, that looks delicious. <laughs> That's how we know it's not a real log. Okay, okay. They're trying to pull a prank on us. Okay. I must try to stay focused, I guess. So I don't miss out on too many beads because we want to get gold. And here is an enemy. A haunted tree! <laughs> Just like I expected. Okay, I think I know what we'll have to do. So tell me guys, how is the weather at your place where you live? I know that's kind of boring subject to speak of, but it's raining like freaking fudge, as I was saying, and it would be fun to know how the weather is at your guys' place. Doesn't matter when you're watching this, just drop me a comment and give me some information. It would be fun. Oh, spooky dude! Okay, I better suck these poor fellas up and do like that. Oh, do, 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 a bonus wheel thing. I'm glad I picked that up. I guess it's pretty hard to know where everything is at this level since... Oh, fudge! Oh, we got everything back. Thank goodness. Oh, here's another treasure. So we'll have to do like that. Theme from Weird Woods. Awesome, the music is... Very soothing, very relaxing, doodly doodly. <laughs> okay, let's make our way back to that electrocuted thing. And here is... Oh, fudge! Fudge, give me back my delicious star beads! There we go. Oh, I'm glad I got all of them back again. Man, I need to step up. I need to bring my A game. <laughs> okay, just do like that, I guess. Let's see what's going on in this area. We have gold, so all I have to do is to carry my ass to the finishing line, I guess. And not die, of course. And that thing is a flipper doodly thing. It kind of makes me remember Sonic 
you know, for the old school Sega. Kind of awesome feeling. Okay. Oh, fudge! Where's this? Oh, there we go. Some more delicious beads. Thanks for that. So, making progress. And so far, this level has been super, super fun, actually. Oh, fudge! No! I did it again! Come back, all delicious star beads. I'm sorry for being so mean to you guys. <laughs> and, um... I don't know if you guys can hear it, but right now it seems like I am in the middle of a storm. Hmm, and if I just let go of the V remote, um, the airship is dragged down, and there we have a whole load of bees once again. Seems like this haunted tree is full of them. So, Kamel, we need two more of those spiky balls in order to take the tree out, and they should do it. Just like that. I'm still looking for the last treasure. Hope we can find it somewhere. Oh! I have them all! Hmm, have I been sleeping the whole time? <laughs> no, I have not been sleeping. That's for sure. Hopefully we can get the maximum number of this bonus wheel just like that. Awesome! I'm celebrating with some delicious tap water, guys! Man, I can really hear the rain smothering at my windows. Well, that's kind of scary, kind of cozy. At the same time, me myself, for the most of the part, I like rain. It's, it's very relaxing in some way. Everything is so quiet except the pearls falling down in those beautiful shapes. But back to the game. Snap out of it, fruit shaped. Okie dokie, looks like we have completed this land. I managed to get gold on every delicious level, and I also grabbed all the treasures. So, let's take our all ingredients bill and move on to Hotland. <laughs> so, Hotland, by the name of it, hmm, I'm gonna pick a chance and say that we're gonna fool around in lava or something like that. Pyramid Sands, okay, they proved me wrong right off the bat, but. Here we go, Pyramid Sands. I've been to Egypt several times. I love it there. I've been to the pyramids a bunch of times. It's a great thing to look at. You just get stunned. You can't even believe how they managed to build something like that. Oh man, it just... I get a tear in my eye. Eye. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, he's trying to charge at me. I kind of like this quicksand thing, how they made it. There we go, okie dokie. Kind of reminds me of a certain level in um, New Super Mario Bros. Wii. <laughs> if you guys have played that game, you probably know what I'm talking about. That's what it's all about. Okay, another one of these guys. Ooh, he carried a load of beads. Thanks for that. Camel sofa. Oh man, that looks pretty neat. Sitting on this sofa will make you feel like the Desert King of Comfort. Also, maybe I will go back to my apartment later on, switch out my flower sofa for this more exotic one. <laughs> it's all about exotic. Okay, let's see now. What's going on up here? Just a bunch of more beads, and we want to grab them, so we take our... Parachute and do like that. Bronze so far. Let's see. We can't go down here right now. <laughs> there we go. That made it work. And I'm gonna take this with me in case we're facing some enemies. There we go. Make the, it made the things a little bit easier, actually. Removing one of the spares. Ooh, uh, we have faced one of these before. So, all we have to do is follow it. And that enemy down below me. Oh, he was just sleeping. I'm gonna teabag you. Oh, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Kirby, snap out of it. You're the hero. You're supposed to be a role model. <laughs> there we go. Just a few of them delicious ones. And I wonder if it's possible to get up here. It should be. Huh. Wait a second. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do like this, of course, my little horse. And there we go. Another one added to the bonus wheel, and 
the second treasure, cactus juice. Cactus juice is an acquired taste. It has a kick to it. Hmm, could you get high on that? I think Kirby will have to try it out. I do not want to do that myself, though. <laughs> okay, reaching Zilver. And we're actually making some good progress in this game so far. I gotta tell you guys, I'm having a blast with this game. Some of you guys have been pointing out, telling me, Hey Fruit Chip, this game looks too easy, you cannot die, but that isn't something that bothers me too much, to be honest. I mean, games doesn't have to be super hard or challenging in order for them to be enjoyable. So I really love this game so far, and I hope the gameplay value is going to be as it is so far. So here we go, we are on our way to uh, grab gold. And that dude is just trying to create some chaos for us. There we go. Can we... Yeah, we could actually do that. Awesome. And we got some beads out of that, so that's good. It's good, it's good. <laughs> okay, we'll have to figure out a way to get up there later on. Uh, yeah, we're missing the last treasure. So we're gonna look for that. Oh no! Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was close. I think I know what we'll have to do. Oh fudge. Oh, this should work. There we go. Now we can go up this wind safely and grab another bonus wheel thingy. Okie dokie. Going good so far, I have to admit. And. Uh... Oh fudge! My bad. Come on! Get back to it! Get up there! Oh, we got them all back, I think. Another super transformation! Here we go! We are turning into a racer cart! A desert cart! Awesome! Okay... Oh, we are entering a race! How awesome! <laughs> okay, there we go! We grab the booze! A booze! A boost! Booze is something you drink! <laughs> Oh, move out of the way! Make room for Kirby the hero! Lord Kirby to be more exact. This kind of reminds me of Exit Bike for Nintendo 8-bit. Man, I played that game a lot when I was a little kid. And there we go, we're making progress. There we go, get out of the way! You do not know how to drive a desert car. Not like Kirby anyway. Here we go, and the last treasure as well, the theme for this level called Pyramid Sands. I'll take that and just move on, we have a race to finish. Here we go, yay! Kirby Kart 64. <laughs> or maybe not. Oh, go away. I do not want to share this with you guys. There we go. <laughs> Kirby is such an evil, evil little cute thing. I'll take all the goodies. Just like that, and this should be the end. Yeah, it is. Okie dokie. This level was actually really fun. Kinda good variation going on compared to the levels in Grassland. So there we go, guys. All the treasure and almost 3,000 beads collected. Mm -mm. Oh boy. You know what, guys? I think I will go back, talk to Doom Hool. And maybe he can introduce us to his brothers. He's been nagging about that for a while, so... You found the magic lamp patch. Oogly dookie. But yeah, I would like you... Yeah, you see guys, he's still nagging about that. Get off my back! <laughs> so we're going back, let him introduce us to his... Uh, brothers. You mess with the fro, you gotta go. If you guys seen the movie Undercover Brother, you probably know what I'm talking about when I'm saying you mess with the bro, you gotta go. <laughs> I just love that little scene. Okay, here he is. Uh, okay. Oh, here is his brothers. Well, it seems that my brothers have decided to stop the... Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Let's do a retake. Well, it seems that my brothers have decided to set up their shops here. <laughs> right next to one another. Hmm, well, I suppose that makes things convenient. Hello there, I am Chase Hool. If you need furniture, I'm your man. I'm Loomis Hool. I have the best fabric shop in Patchland. The only one too. Visit them whenever you need something. 
Okie dokie. So those guys are gonna sell stuff for us if we want that, so to say. But yeah, guys, this will be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a lovely day, and I will smell you later.